Hi everyone, Liz here, thanks for stopping by. So, today I've got a little teeny tiny package and a funny story with this one. Uh, when I uh, brought it upstairs last night and put it on my desk, that happened. Can you see that? <laughs> Shall I do it again? <laughs> so, I think you can probably tell what these are. Uh, I certainly, well, it made me laugh anyway, and in the dark it looked even brighter. So, yeah, I'll put a little uh, little video of uh, it last time. <laughs> oh, well, I know what's in that package. Yeah, it just really made me laugh. So I thought, oh, well, I know what these are. So I've opened it and uh, double-checked them. Yeah, that's what they are. <laughs> so they're like, like these little um, slap key rings, I think they are. Um, well, I call them slap anyway. I'm not quite sure what they are. <laughs> Keychains, whichever actually, I don't know whether this has got a keychain on it or not. I'll have a look. Uh, and yeah, when you uh, tap them, they light up. But I just thought it was really funny last night. I got this little parcel and I thought, well, I'll take it upstairs, put it in my craft room, and then uh, I'll do an unboxing on it. And uh, yeah, I just pop them on the desk and bump, they all lit up. And I thought, I know what they are. <laughs> so uh, I've seen uh, a couple of other people. Let's just get these out first. Can't hear me over the crinkling. <laughs> so yeah, I've seen a couple of other people unbox these. So uh, oh yeah, they're a keychain. So where does it hang through? Ah, right, okay. Yep, so let me just have a look. We've got let me get uh, get a pair of tweezers. We do have a little like dent there just a little hole and if you just pop that through let's just come out there and push it through that way so we do have a little hole at the top for the key ring to go through i was looking at it thinking oh where does it go but i've noticed sometimes when you get um key rings and things at the moment and uh, little hanging special drills that uh, they're not fully punched through it's still there so yeah just get some tweezers or a little thin pair of scissors and just poke it through it just pokes through really easily but how cute is that and look at her eyelashes that they're pretty and we've got a lovely little love hat on her tummy and she's double-sided so yeah i just thought these were really cute and i thought oh, i'll have to have some of them and i thought the owl was nice i mean she's pink so what can i say but they are quite weighty actually as well um to have your keys and everything i suppose you could use it as a bag charm as well that'd be quite a funny if you bump up against somebody and your key ring lights up they'll wonder what on earth's going on won't they <laughs> might actually if you've got them i'm not sure doesn't stay on brilliantly long and um, but i suppose if you're looking for your keys in your bag if you knock your bag um it'll light up and you can find it or even if you're looking for your keyhole on your door give it a tap and you can have a look <laughs> oh i'm gonna have to <coughs> excuse me i'm gonna have to stop doing that otherwise i'll wear the batteries out won't i i don't think you can take them apart to get the uh, batteries in they're like a very very thick acrylic there so let's give a uh, little owly a quick measure we'll go from tip of her bow oh look she's lit up again already uh, so that is eight centimetres, which is just over three inches that way. And the widest part of her wings is eight centimetres, just over three inches. So, yeah, she's a nice size. And the width, I would say, is about half a centimetre. Yeah, roughly half a centimetre thick. So, as I say, they are quite um, a thick little key ring. But, yeah, isn't she cute? <laughs> Oh, I just love those eyelashes and the fact that it lights up. What can I say? I'm a big kid at heart. <laughs> so the little key ring that we've got. Okay. So, oh, we've got uh, a lobster claw clasp there. So that's quite uh, a nice one. Oh, that's stiff. Goodness me. That one's not wanting to play. And then we've got the little chain. That loops through itself so that'll loop through there and then the other end will loop through and you just clasp it through uh, the 
a little clasp there okay quite a standard keychain really um, that you get with a lot of the things but that's quite nice no jump rings to fiddle about with oh yay i've had so much trouble with jump rings on these smashing the special ones we've been doing ah actually do you know i'm going to put those back in there before i lose them right so it's a basic toolkit which is your pen your wax and your boat most places are baggies so just a number one toolkit and let's have a look at the drills. We seem to have quite a few drills, quite a few colours. We're up to number six there, so I'll see if it's folded over anymore. I can see some love hearts. Oh! We're still in February, so let's feel the love of Valentine's Day. Oh gosh, I've got a lot of colours. Blimey! I suppose it's double sided, but wow. Lots of colours. So. We have a bronzy brownie colour and a blue and a pinky red and a pale pink. It's not quite a hot pink, that is more red than hot pink. And a plain silver and a very, very pale pink. Wow. And your standard black and the silver marquees that have got the iridescent coating on, the AB coating. And so I love those, like the fire ready orange. Uh, faceted larger rounds and some little faceted teardrops i'm hoping you can see these okay yeah i think they're coming out okay again with uh, an iridescent coating on an ab coating and so oh some fire red teardrops they're nice and then the little pink and oh, now they are hot pink that is hot pink hot pink hearts and we only need two and the center's seven yeah, seven. Yay! We've got five spare. Oh, feel the love. <laughs> okay, so that's our little owl. Pop those back in there. And then, just pop the little owly there. Oh, it's not coming on. Just give her a quick tap and pop her over there. <laughs> and then we have our little moor. The little moo cow. Okay. It's another key ring again. I didn't tell you where I got these from, did I? Let me see if I can find it. Okay, these are from the, the Pro Houseware store on AliExpress and they cost me all together for the two with uh, I got a small shipping fee of 56 pence and tax came to £9.91 so that's that about just under £5 eight I think for a bit of fun they're quite good but yeah it gave the cow a slap <laughs> but yeah she sat down or he sat down and uh, yeah again double sided but it's just the way sat with the legs out and the little hooves there just give him a tap and yep, that hole is already through there. You can see at the top. Okay. Again, stand. Oh, lighting up again. Look, standard toolkit. At least I think that's the hooves. Yeah, that's the hooves. Look from the front legs. So, yeah, that's definitely, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Same keyring again, the little lobster claw clasp with the little chain to go through there. Look at that licky face. Oh. <gasps> Looks like it's all stand gems apart from the one in the middle, but we'll have a look and see. Let's give it a quick measure as well, see how big we are. I think we'll be about the same size as the owl. Uh, yeah, just under three in oh no, just under three inches, so a little bit smaller widthways, which is seven centimeters by uh, eight centimeters, three and a quarter inches. So. Uh, pretty much they had quite a few different ones as well but these are the two that just jumped out at me you know i like my cute i love cute what can i say okay let's have a look at these gems right oops they don't make them any easier to get into was the pride oh where is it where is it there it is <laughs> So, 
we start off with our standard black, of course, because I think we're a Frisian cow, we're a black and white cow. And that's Frisian, not freezing, although it is uh, fairly cold today. Uh, then there's like that grey silver colour there. And we have your standard silver. Your real bubblegum pink. A lovely red colour. And that goldy colour there. And then, yep, yeah, just your gold marquees, faceted marquees. Uh, to go. I think that must be... Oh, it's a bell. It's got a bell around its neck. Duh. I'm thinking, what is that? Has it got a necktie on it? What's it got? It's a bell, Liz. It's a cow with a bell round its neck. <laughs> oh, 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 we're off again. Shall we set them both off together? Just... Yay! Disco! Do, 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 do. Oh dear, sorry, that's just a child in me. Do you ever go around toy shops with the kids or even on your own? Ah, and uh, if it says, press to try, do you go around and press them all and drive the staff mad? Sorry if you work in a toy shop. I'm that person. <laughs> oh dear. So yeah, I'm quite pleased with these. I'm looking forward to doing them. They're just a sort of like a little evening's project, aren't they? Probably what an hour to half a half an hour to an hour to do with them but just that little bit of fun and just um yeah i think if you gave that as a present to anybody uh it's just going to make them smile and i think if you're stood in a shop and somebody sets it off you're going to make people smile either that or they'll send for the people in white coats to come and take you away i'm not quite sure which but uh, yeah Okay, well, I hope you've enjoyed looking at these with me. If you have, if you can give me a thumbs up, it's always much appreciated. And if you want to come back and see more and see what I get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button and the all notifications bell next to it, you'll be notified when my next videos come out. So thanks ever so much for stopping by and I hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.